Welcome everyone, it's Load Start Plays here, and today I'm going to be starting my second blind playthrough of the year, and this is going to go alongside uh, Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. And it is, of course, Spyro Reignited Trilogy. I've been waiting for a while to play this one. Um, me, personally, I have more history with Spyro than Crash. Um, with Crash, I haven't really played any of his games. I did play a few levels um, here and there, but I wasn't like massive with it. With Spyro, on the other hand, I did not get to play the first two games, but I did, however, on the PlayStation 1, played the third game. Um, I didn't get very far. I was quite young, um, so it was a bit difficult for me, but um, that so far is my favourite. Of course, I haven't played the first two, so I don't know if it will be later, but uh, oh, what's this? Uh, blah, 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 blah. Can I skip all the way down? Um, I accept all of that. Um, start game. Uh, say slot one? Yeah, sure. Uh, Spyro the Dragon. So, um, yeah. Now, I'm not sure how exactly I'm going to, uh, plan these out when KH3 is around, because I do want to do that. You know, KH3 is the game I am waiting for. Um, so I don't know. I may put Crash and Spyro here and there. Uh, it may be a bit random at times, so, yeah. But I have been waiting a while to start this. Um, in the world of dragons, uh, I have no idea what the story is in any free, really. I, of, of course, know the start of the third one. But not. I don't remember very much at the same time. Um, I don't even remember how far I got. I don't think I made it past the first hub world. But yeah. Okay, rolling. Uh, oh, oh uh, it's been peaceful here in the five worlds, or is it six? <laughs> For this is reminding me of four, actually, at the moment. Twelve thousand treasure, or is it fourteen thousand? What about this Ganasty Ganok character? Now, I understand he's done a magic spell to turn gems into warriors for his cause. I'll take that question. Nasty Nork is a simple creature. Simple? Ow. In a remote world and is no threat to the Dragon Kingdom. No threat? Besides, he is ugly. Ugly? Don't ask me why, but this reminds me of America vs. North Korea. <laughs> uh. Well, I mean, eh. You either call them ugly. You kind of know what you They don't get deserved to be crystallized for that. But yeah, I'm guessing he's a bad guy. Um, simple plot, I guess. Um, which I'm okay with. Uh, so yeah, the adventure begins. Um, okay, I just want to say this off the bat. Um, this game looks and plays a little bit better than Crash, at least in my opinion. Anyway, we rescued Nesta. Um, Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons in the artisan world, then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. What about Nasty Nork? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm guessing that's what we have to do. We have to click them. Um. Okay. Oi, come here. There we go. Ooh. Okay, yeah, I definitely like this game. Obviously, I'm judging this a bit early, as well as uh, with Crash, but I, so far, I'm, I like the feel of Spyro more personally. Um, oh, I got a skill point. I don't know what that is. Uh, but yeah, that's just how I feel personally. Um, but I still like Crash and everything. Um, Crash is probably a little bit more difficult. At least that's how I feel anyway. Oh, here's our second one. Hey, Spyro, press the jump button. Oh, he's got a nice hat. And, and don't be afraid. Afraid of what? Falling from high mountain peaks? Plummeting into prehistoric glaciers? Oh, that. Oh, yeah. 
That wouldn't scare, scare me. Um, hmm. Okay. That failed. Come here. Was that what I was supposed to do? Oh, I've got to chase him around. Okay, I will say this, the motion blur is a bit annoying. Um, I've never liked motion blur in games. Especially in horror games. I feel like they go overboard with it. It makes you start feeling sick. But, uh, yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot that in the um, options you can uh, choose um, the music between the old and the original. Um, I think I just turned it on. To, yeah, I'll see what the original sounds like. What's map on? Okay. Um, oh, I see. That's the map. Um, I don't know if I should ha have the map on or off. I'll have it off for the meantime. Um, I'm actually looking to see if there's any subtitles. Um, I don't think there is. Which is kind of sad because I actually like playing games with subtitles. Um, okay, I don't think... I want to kind of complete this area before moving on to another area. I know I missed the uh, stuff down here. Oh, miss you too. Oh, in the comments, if you want, tell me if you want me to switch to the reignited music or the original. Um, because, oh, dang it. Real bad with the platforming in both Crash and Spyro, but, um, Tell me if you want the reignited music on or the original. I actually kind of like the original more, personally, but... I don't know. We'll see. Right. Let's see if we can free some more dragons. Um... I missed the stuff up here. Again, this is 100% blind. I'm, I'm kind of happy that I am doing now blind playthroughs on things again. I... Like with Horizon Zero of Dawn and Shadow of the Colossus, it's much more fun playing games blind than it is a game that you already know. I know I did uh, do that through all of the, um, I'm guessing that's a balloonist. But yeah, I, I know I um, did a lot of the Kingdom Hearts games that I've already played a thousand times. But I kind of wanted to because, you know, it was kind of like the road to Kingdom Hearts 3. Uh, you know, just building up to it, which I'm happy that I did do. These guys are really slow. Alright, here we go. Is that everything? It looks like it. Here's another dragon. So I need one more, because here were four. Oh, he's a painter. Keep your horns on, Spyro! You have much to learn first. <laughs> He's not wrong. What the dragonfly following you is doing? Uh... His name is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting you. Keep an eye on him and see what I mean. All right. So yes, I knew that Sparks is your health, and when you get hit, he changes colors. Um, I think it goes gold to blue, then green, and then once you get hit when he's green, you lose Spark. And then, the next time you get hit, you actually die, die. Oh! You can't go into water. And now you see he is blue. So, yeah. Um... Okay, I think... Did I go this way? Let me have a quick look. Okay, I did. That's where the balloonist is, I think. Um... And we ha you get health by destroying, like, smaller creatures and they release butterflies and then sparks eats them and you get health oh i see down this way i cannot wait to start playing the third one again that was my favorite okay oh this guy's a big one do that again the artisan's boss is through a portal in the dragon mouth but you are not yet ready, Spyro. 
first, you must complete one of the other artisan lands. Okay. Uh, so I can't go through there. Is there any gems? Am I missing any? I think I am, because it, I'm pretty sure I'm missing four. Okay. Um, wait, was it four? Yeah, it's four. So, where are they, Spark? Oh. I know that if you press down on the left analog stick, uh, Spark shows you, or hints at where the gems you're missing are. Oh. Well, here's some. I didn't even see uh, the first time coming down here that there was a way here. Okay, well now I'm just missing two. Oh, and they're right there. Oh, well, there we go. We got all the gems in the first hub world. So yeah, I think that is a good place to leave it. Um, so yeah, now I think I think for the uh, next part we will be going to Stone Hill. So yeah, feel free to leave a like and subscribe. This was Load Start Plays, uh, playing Spyro Reignited Trilogy. Uh, Spyro 1 to be exact. So yeah, uh, I guess I'll see you in the next part. We will be doing Stonehill. So yeah, bye.